He-Man. First of all, I'd like to welcome you all to Sacramento, California. Thank you so much for finally making it here. Hey! Yeah, hey. you know, it's lovely. Hey. Last time we tried to make it to Sacramento, Snow. we got caught up in a Shasta Mountain Pass. Stuck in the snow. Uh, Jerry and I weed. had to cut Just the chains. You were in weed. With our own. No, <laughs> we were, we were uh, at the Klondike Inn. It could have been a lot of The Klondike, Klondike is you know the, the Klondike best Klondike place in the world. <laughs> that is Seriously, so if you're in Shasta, go there. Go to the Klondike. They got good meals. You you're a bad person. Ribs they got good meals. And good okay. hospitality. I got a question for you guys. We got an answer. How, <laughs> how did you all meet? The Price is Right. Yep. You met on The Price is Right? The Seriously. The Price is Right. Wait, Drew Carey, Price we, is we Right, or Bob Barker? Uh, Bob Barker. Okay. okay. But yeah, we, Old the three of us right. went to The Price is Right as friends, and Uncle was sitting there with a flute. But this dude's here with our guitar. And that, that was how it all happened. That's amazing. Yeah. It's crazy. The, the Price is right. right brought us all together. <laughs> come on down. Thank you, Bob Barker. Bob Barker. <laughs> hey, come on down. <laughs> Don't forget to spay you do your pets. So out of all the places in California, why did you guys choose to come to Sacramento? Well, we uh, recently scheduled a 100-city tour uh, this past uh, year, and we asked the fans to, you know, go to our website, 100MuppetsMusic.com, and uh, vote on the cities that they want us to play. Sacramento was one of the few top cities that we had. Yeah. So during our first leg of our 100-city tour, we were extremely depressed to be, uh, you know, kind of thwarted by the snow and everything. So we got stuck up in Shasta Pass. Luckily, the Klondike saved us, and we had a good time that night. But uh, we weren't able to play Sacramento. So now we, here we are about six months later and we're back in town. Sacks town. Man, we love it here. Thank you. We love you too. Oh, much appreciated. Much so, appreciate. so how, over here. <laughs> so how many, <laughs> how many instruments do you guys all play? Because I noticed that you guys were all around the, the stage kind of doing, you know, different things. Uh, Uncle, you seem to play like three or four, right? More than that. Oh, more. Okay, yeah, you kind of look like you might come from Memphis or something. You know what's going on. <laughs> well, truthfully speaking, I'm from Mars. He's from yeah. Mars. I've this is the truth. truth. I, I love know, you. I, I love you. Yes. I have I have friends in Venus now. Another one. Fantastic. <laughs> That's where we're So, wait, from, right? how many instruments? Uh, you were like on five tonight, right? Well, we all play uh, pretty much every instrument that you see on stage. Every single one of us can play, at least to some degree. And uh, throughout the course of the night, we like to kind of switch it up. We like to give the audience a different kind of show. A lot of times people go to a show, like say, if you're an interviewer, and, uh, or, or a music review artist, you go and you see a show and you're used to the same singer fronting the same songs. Right? Right. But uh, we like to switch that up. We like to give the audience a different genre of music every other song or so. Therefore, we, we like to play a different instrument every song or so. We want to keep it fresh. We want to keep it new and keep the audience involved. We don't want to ever, like, have one sound. We never want to be defined. We define our own music as uh, onomatopoetic. I love it. And uh, people define us as funky rock and roll. I'll take funky rock and roll. I don't mind it. Yeah. You know, I'll side with that. Yeah. yeah. But at the end of the day, our music is what our music is. It's eclectic and it's sincere. How did you guys come up with the name 100 Monkeys? Uh, we were like, man, what should we call the band? 100 <laughs> Monkeys. That sounds good, right? Yeah, no, no. <laughs> Do you guys know who Will Wheaton is from Star Trek? Yes! yes. Okay. Yeah. Will was a friend of mine back in the day, and Will had this website called The Hundred Monkeys, where he would write all of his, like, you know, oh, opinions mu musings, like musings, you know? yes. And uh, I thought it was totally random, and I was searching 100 Monkeys one day to see if I could find Will's website. I found you guys. That's so awesome. I was like playing in the upcoming Twilight conventions. Well, basically, the way it kind of works out with that is sometimes they announce uh, certain performers that are going to appear, regardless if they've contacted the performer. Or I not. see. <laughs> um, but they're very sweet people. What yes. they do is they they, they kind of like lend out this uh, this branch, basically of uh, hey, if you want to come out, you can come out. But the problem is we have other things half the time. So we, we never know, honestly, sometimes before, like two weeks before. Like usually we'll, we'll always dedicate it two weeks before. But if you're ever interested in what 100 Monkeys are doing, you go to 100monkeysmusic.com. That is the premier source of where we will be and what we will be doing. <laughs> that's right, that's right, that's right. That's right. I missed that. Can, that's right. Can you tell me about Captain Crunch? <laughs> Captain Crunch is an amazing cereal. Why not? Uh, 
Wait, you know I Captain Crunch? It. I do, I know Marshall? Captain Crunch, actually. Yeah. Captain Crunch is the lead guitar player for Band of Bigfoot. Yep. Tom Harris, Shreddy the Yeti. <laughs> he's one of the most talented guitar players I've ever met, and yep. he's educated every single person in this band. I was going to say, I think all of you guys are pretty freaking talented a, on the guitar, too. A whole <laughs> he, he rubbed up on us. Man, and it's because of people like him that people like us are able to, to love everyone else. Thank you. So, Tom. The Tom. Band the oh, oh, the band of Bitcoin. Yes! Oh. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you so, so much. Nice Thank you, Tom. Much appreciate it. So much.